www.wordpressmaster.com here to demonstrate how to use the WordPress command line WPCLI to do a search and replace for your HTTPS WordPress site conversion. I'm going to log into a test site here. I am using PuTTY, which is an open source SSH client for Windows desktop. It's not very pretty looking, but it's free and it does the job. In order to log in, you're going to need to know your host name or IP address. You're going to need your username. You're going to need your password. And now you are logged into the command line of your web host. We can do a, a list here and it will show me all the directories that are below me. And I need to traverse to the, to the WordPress directory, the directory that holds our WP config file. And that on my server is public underscore HTML. And now when I look at the directory, I see all my WordPress files, including WP config. So I'm in the right place to issue WPCLI commands. And the first one I'm going to show you is WP help. All WPCLI commands start with WP. And help is going to list all the subcommands. And you can scroll through that at any time and get help no matter where you are. Let's get help for a specific command. Let's look at what our database commands are. So you can issue WP help and then a subcommand. And it shows you that you can reset the current database. You can create a new database. You can do queries and all sorts of things. Before I do anything with my database, I want to make a copy of it. I want to export it. I want to do a backup. And that command is WP DB export. And I'm going to put the backup file in the directory above me. So I don't want it to be public facing. Anything in public.html is accessible to the public over the internet. So I'm going to call it my backup. And so now I have a backup of, of my database. And when I do a directory listing, I see it, my backup right here, date and time. There's the size. Okay. Now we're going to go back to our WordPress directory. Now I'm going to demonstrate search and replace. The command is WP search dash replace the item that you're looking for, the item that you want to replace it with, and then a couple of flags. The flags we're using are dry run, which will not change the database and report changed only. And you see it executed here. This is the report of everything that would be changed. It tells you the, the table where the content was found, the column where it was found, and how many times it was found. So where we here we have in our post table, we have five replacements, and it tells you how many the total is, success, and the phrase here is eight replacements to be made. These haven't been made because we did the dry run flag, which is dash dash dry dash run. Now let's try the whole thing again. This time I'm going to limit our changes only the post table, which in my case is WJD underscore posts. So now we see only the five post content columns being changed. But again, this is a dry run. So now we're going to do the whole thing for real without the dry run. So in this case, what we're doing here is we're replacing all references to YouTube HTTP to those over the secure protocol HTTPS. So the same command minus the dry run, five replacements, success, and that's it. That's how you do a search and replace using the WordPress command line. I hope you found this helpful. Yeah.